Good morning, grandkids. I'm not going to comb my hair today because I'm tired and it's not worth the energy. So for all my friends or family that are watching this right now, you may not have seen an entry go up on Monday and that's because I made it but didn't upload it. I'm going to be doing this thing every once in a while with this, with this journal where my grandkids are going to see every entry, but the people right now of the internet will not see every entry because some of the topics that I discuss may not be appropriate for everybody to know. To be completely honest, there was this poem that I wrote after my grandmother died and I didn't plan on it but I ended up deciding to read it in the last entry and I kind of started tearing up a little bit and I just didn't think it was really that appropriate for me to put on the general internet. So yeah, that one's going to be going on a hard drive just for my grandkids one day. And you guys don't get to see it. I did talk about a necklace I made for my girlfriend in an awesome experience going caving with one of my best friends, Logan. So you guys kind of miss out on that. Maybe I might try to recut it with just the parts without me reading the poem. I don't know. But in the meantime, you guys don't get any of it. Anyway, in news in my world... We just did auditions for the horror movie that we're going to shoot at the movie theater. As you guys know, I'm working at a movie theater, and I think I might have mentioned it in one of the other entries that we were planning on making a movie in the movie theater, because it's really creepy at night. That was pretty much the only inspiration for this movie, was like working really, really late and having to walk in a dark theater and being like, ooh, this is creepy. Then we were like, hey, let's make a movie about it. So, and because I obviously want to make movies, two of the managers came to me and were like, hey, let's make a movie. And and now we're making a movie, but one of the managers dropped out of making the movie, so now it's just me and one of the other managers, and we finished writing a script, and we just did auditions for some of the characters for the movie. I'll be acting one part, and I think we have three other people that are going to be acting other parts, so we're going to be doing another audition um, tonight for somebody else. Anyway, the auditions were really fun. I didn't really audition for any parts just because I wrote a part that I was going to perform so it didn't really matter, but I got to help some other people with their auditions, so I still got to act a little bit, and I got to cuss a lot, because we wrote a lot of curse words into this, because it's a horror movie, and people think that they're gonna die, and I think that usually people don't withhold from cussing when they're about to die, so that's how we wrote the dialogue. The, the entire script for that is about 50 pages, which means it's gonna end up being somewhere between half an hour to an hour long of a movie, and that's the longest piece of film that I've ever done. So that's going to be kind of exciting. Uh, we're looking to start filming in October, the very beginning. Uh, right now that we have our auditions, I filmed it all. So we're looking over all, all of our uh, tapes. And we're going to have a schedule made. And starting in October, we're just going to be filming. So that's really cool. And I'm going to be doing a lot for that. I'm going to be doing pretty much all of the cinematography. I did half of the writing, I'm going to be acting, I'm going to be writing all of the music for that, I'm going to be doing all of the special effects for that, I'm going to be doing some of the makeup for that, and I'm going to be the general like electrician, lighting person, and props manager for the entire thing. So pretty much, I'm making 80% of this movie, and it's going to be insane. Also, I was talking about those Australian film schools that I was going to apply for, and I decided that before I applied for them, I wanted to make a short film that showed off a lot of my like uh, skills that I have uh, as far as filmmaking is concerned. So I wrote up a 13-page script for a kind of sci-fi adventure story set in the future, and I'm going to be filming that as soon as possible. I don't know where I'm going to find a 10 to 14 year old girl though to act because I don't know any 10 to 14 year old actors and I feel like any method of finding a little girl to work on a movie with me is really really creepy so that's gonna be interesting the script isn't that cool or crazy or anything it's just kind of this like sci-fi story that I want to do uh, but I figured it'd be kind of cool if you guys got to see it so I'm going to put it on the hard drive with all the video files along with putting it in the description on the YouTube video, just so regardless of how you guys are accessing this journal, you can read my script if you want, or you don't have to. It's 13 pages and that's a somewhat significant chunk of your life. It's, it takes like three or four minutes to read, so it's not that bad. But if you don't want to waste three or four minutes on my script, I, I understand. So anyway, grandchildren, if you see me anytime in the me, future, you, present, then 
I want you to make a, 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 a dessert of some sort with me. We'll bake. Or maybe in the future, everyone's vegan and we'll make some kind of vegan dessert. So let's do that. See you guys.